Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Okay, so first, can you introduce uh, introduce yourself first? My name is Felix. I'm 10 years old. I'm from Kudus, Indonesia. Okay, so in the screen, I think you're already making a project in Pitongtok. So first, can you tell me uh, the name of your project? I'm making a project called Kenali Tempat Sampah. Okay, Kenali Tempat Sampah. Okay, uh, is there any reason did you make this project or how, uh, why did you make this project? The reason I'm making this project is to make people really that they must throw their dress in a right place. And also, people need to separate their dress. So the dress can be processed according to yeah. this type. Okay, uh, I think that's a really good reason for to make this project. Uh, okay, and the next, so can you demonstrate uh, how this project works exactly? The project, the project is really simple. We just need to click on the dress and Toby. If I click Toby's green dress can. The speech recognize The speech recognition AI will try to recognize what we see. For, for example, if I say green, then the project will speak green dress can is for organic dress. And if we we'll do the same, same. If I say red, yellow, or red, and if I say anything besides green, red, yellow, or red word, the project will remain And for the first bite, it the same process with Toby Sprites. Would like to beat the Okay, so I think that's a very good uh yeah, that simple. We put that simple work in your project. So for the next, I think we can try to uh, see what kind of project you use based on the first one is on Toby. Um, it's kind of simple. You're just using if else, but with some uh, I block recognize speech. So can you explain uh, how the code work in the Toby sprite? In Toby code. I only use the if else function to make sure the speech AI can detect some words that I say and if I say one of some option in this if else the project will gonna say something as feedback of what I say. Okay, uh, good. And I think for the next one, you can click one of the dress as right. Yeah, maybe light. Okay, so I'm kind of interested in the when this spread click is almost same with the Toby, but there is some little bit difference that you just let and write. So I think can you? So I wanna ask. Uh, can you explain the slide sprite when the sprite is got click? 
uh, please. For the dress code, I use almost the same if else statement in Toby code, but I add the glad code. So the dress will glad to the dress pin for the height spine. The dress will disappear as the dress go into the dress pin. Okay, good. It's simple, but yet it's good. Uh, uh, just like the people, when people throwing the dress to the dress bit. And I think I'm kind of curious to the spread on the right side. It's called Isaac. Okay. Can you click on the Isaac spread? Okay. Uh, this one is a little bit different. So can you explain uh, how this code work in Isaac? For the Isaac code, it only change the background to show the user what if they didn't throw their trust in the trust pin. Okay, so can you click on the Isaac? I want to see what kind of background is that. Oh, okay. So just like uh, how people, non, I'm sorry, not how, but what if people didn't throw the trash into the trash bin and you show it on the background. Good. So I think that's all. Um, it's a really good project. The code that you use is uh, simple, but yet it's really good and it works very well uh so i think that's for all uh thank you for making this project felix and see you goodbye bye